So this is my little area with like I consider my life. Uh, this is me. Chubby little three-year-old me, those little beefy arms. I don't look much different, do I? Let's see. A little bit. Uh, this is a big one. I got to hold a koala in Australia. I thought that was pretty awesome. Australia is a great country. Love you there. Grandparents up here. Grandparents with my mom when she was a baby. Some really classic photos I started to collect a couple of years ago. I love this one. I mean, it just looks like a postcard. Him with the classic car, my mom as a baby. So cute. This is dad with no shirt on. <laughs> this photo was on the landing going up my stairs my whole life. So one day I went home and said, I want to duplicate that. It's so cute. I got to have a photo taken with the trophy, the NBA trophy this year. They brought it into Sirius and I got to touch it before it went out there. It was pretty awesome. So just a good variety of love right here. I like it when my guests go to the restroom, they can see my family, my wife. Uh, Christmas Day was a big tradition. There's always a home Lakers game. This year it's gonna be Lakers Clippers. So when my friends and I go, I have a nice little picture here. Trevor Ariza, who I really thought was gonna stick with the Lakers when I hung this and then didn't. Kobe Bryant, having a Kobe ball is just, you know, it's legendary. Kobe in his last year this season. Gonna retire and I'm glad that I have that. And on my landing, I have my awards. And one day I hope to have more books that I've read than awards that I've won. I've started with this small stack. There's more, but I've loaned some of them out. So I have a good variety of stuff here, right? These are beautiful awards. I don't quite know what I'm gonna do with them, but for now, they look perfect right here and they remind me of where I've come from. You see, I have a nice range of uh, jerseys hanging and there's some being added soon but one of the funny things is you'll notice a lot of these players are from Pittsburgh so originally born in Pittsburgh and I have a very good fan who I've known my entire career who uh, the flurry jersey he's like I will get you jerseys but they will be athletes who were born in Pittsburgh so where's your Jim Kelly it's coming I just got a Frank O'Harris My very first pro basketball game was at the Spectrum. It was the 76ers, and it was in 1983. And in 1983, the 76ers took it all. They won everything. This is a team signed jersey with a matching ball. And then a Dr. J jersey with a matching ball. And Dr. J had a book that came out last year and ran through Sirius and did some interviews. I read the book. It was, it was such a great, it just a great way to remember how different the NBA was back then and how different their lives were. Basketball is my number one favorite So uh, I did some work on the Black Swan. I did some work on the Black Swan and also Noah, so I'm waiting to get those posters framed hung over there. I was on set for the last two weeks of the production, got to go to the wrap party, got to get my SAG card. My SAG card is under stunts. I did some of Barbara Hershey's double work and I did a little work with them in some scenes where it was just, the movie was unwinding and everybody was getting tired. So it was new energy and it was very fun. I would a cool movie to be a part of. Noah was different. We were running in the mud and they had these, these the irrigation things pouring rain down on us. And I just felt so shredded after shooting that because it's just such good exercise, you know? It was a lot of fun. So I hope to one day do more stunt stuff. If you want to achieve greatness, stop asking for permission.